The Carnation Ambulatory Monitor is the only P-wave-centric cardiac patch monitor and is capable of continuously recording every heartbeat. The cam's center chest placement directly over the heart and its state-of-the-art low-noise circuitry are designed to maximize key elements of the ECG that are critical for accurate heart rhythm diagnosis. The cam patch is designed to accurately record all aspects of the ECG, but especially the often difficult to detect P wave, which is crucial to properly understanding the diverse array heart rhythm disorders and their relationship to a patient's cardiac health concerns. To ensure optimal recording quality and to achieve full duration of the prescribed wear time of the patch, it is essential that the following application instructions be adhered to closely. Locate a clean area that has a flat and firm surface large enough to lay out the contents of the cam box. If any item is missing, contact Barty Diagnostics customer service. Begin by removing all hair over the sternal area by shaving close to the skin. Refrain from merely clipping hair and use a razor to ensure better and complete hair removal. This skin preparation area should extend at least two inches past where the cam patch will be applied. Continue the skin preparation process by thoroughly removing dead skin cells. Using all three prep pads included in the box, scrub the skin well enough so it is slightly reddened, but not raw or painful. After cleaning, allow the area to dry thoroughly without touching it before applying the cam patch, as skin oil on the fingertips may transfer to the application site and interfere with ECG quality. Place the batch road on a hard, flat surface and snap the recorder into place by inserting the narrow end of the recorder into the batch road with the event button facing up. A green LED light will blink for 10 seconds to confirm activation. If the LED does not blink, contact customer service. Following the LED activation sequence, push down on the event button once to ensure the recorder is clicked firmly in place. Please note, the 10 second LED activation blinking will only occur when the recorder is first connected to the batch road and no additional blinking should occur while the cam is being worn by the patient. Take a moment to complete the information requested on the cover of the patient diary, especially recording the precise date and time of when the cam was activated. This information is required to complete patient registration and is vital for accurately matching the proper time of cam activation with the internal clock in the cam. Gently peel the liner from the cam patch by grasping the tab at the top of the device and by peeling downward. Handle the cam carefully by holding onto the top and bottom tabs, ensuring the batch road does not fold over on itself or comes in contact with anything other than the patient's sternum. Prior to applying, ensure the chest is completely bare and free of clothing to optimally place the cam patch. Locate the xiphoid process at the bottom of the sternum and apply the cam to the patient's chest with the bottom part seated over the xiphoid process. Press along the entire edge of the patch for two minutes and then rub firmly around the edges of the patch for one minute to ensure proper adhesion. Secure the cam by placing two fingers on the recorder directly below the event button and gently press it against the chest, being careful not to dislodge the recorder. Instruct patients to gently press the event button once when experiencing symptoms and record the date and time in the patient diary included in the CAM box. Caution patients not to press the event button repeatedly or forcefully, as this can affect the quality of the ECG recording. Review the patient diary and CAM box with the patient and explain their use. Instruct the patient to perform the following post-monitoring directions also described in the patient diary. Remove the CAM from the chest by pulling the tab at the top of the batch road and slowly peeling downward. Affix the device on top of the outline of the monitor on the exterior of the batch road pouch. Wipe off any remaining adhesive on the skin with the adhesive remover wipe pad provided in the box. Insert the cam and the patient diary into the cam box and seal it with the mailer sticker found in the patient diary. Lastly, instruct the patient to return the contents per the instructions of your hospital or clinic. To ensure optimal ECG recording, reinforce the following cautions with the patient. Avoid showering, bathing, or exercising following application. For the remainder of the wear time, 
Avoid activities or environments that result in excessive perspiration, as this may result in a decreased period of patch adhesion and monitoring. When showering, avoid exposing the monitor directly to the water stream. Do not press the event button repetitively or forcefully. Avoid wearing necklaces or underwire bras, as it can disrupt recording. Sports bras or no bras are recommended during wear. For complete instructions and to obtain additional information, including frequently asked questions, visit www.bardydx.com slash cam instructions. And for assistance in setting up, using, and maintaining the cam, or to report unexpected operations or events, contact Bardi Diagnostics Customer Service.